From News 19, I'm meteorologist Daniel Bonds. Valentine's Day is only 15 days from today. Spring begins exactly seven weeks from today. And by the time we get to spring, our average high temperature is closer to the upper 60s to near 70 degrees. We're probably going to be in the upper 50s, low 60s. That's where we were yesterday as well. We did manage to make it up to 61 degrees in the capital city. And you'll notice temperatures have been dropping since Friday. Friday, we made it all the way up to 78 degrees. 71 on Saturday did have a little bit of rain on Saturday, 27 hundredths of an inch of rain, and we've had two confirmed tornadoes. Now at this point, the latest confirmed tornado was over in Richland County. This was an EF1 tornado that impacted parts of the northeast part of Richland County. So no injuries reported with that one. Had winds of about 90 miles per hour, kind of a short-lived storm, but two tornadoes so far confirmed in the Midlands on Saturday. Low temperatures going to be a little bit warmer tomorrow. We have got some clouds that are going to be moving in. Rain will be moving in and so temperatures will be a little bit higher and then our low temperatures will drop back down into the low to mid 30s. It looks like Thursday. That's close to normal for this time of the year. Our average low temperature is close to about 35 degrees. For today we're expecting mostly sunny seasonal conditions. Just mentioned it some rain very early Wednesday. It will be a little bit cooler Wednesday too with the clouds. Today, expecting highs in the mid to upper 50s, low 60s, probably a little bit warmer in the southern half of the Midlands. This is midnight though. Clouds start to build in. You'll notice that chance for some rain, two o'clock Wednesday morning. This is four o'clock and then by the time the sun rises Wednesday morning, most of the rain is out of here. Clouds may stick around through a large portion of the day. As we get to Thursday though, we do expect a good bit of sunshine once again. Next best chance for rain after tonight and early Wednesday morning will be Sunday and there will be a chance for rain on Monday as well. That was the European forecast model. Here's the American forecast model showing basically that same idea, but you'll notice they're showing a little bit more rain on Monday, both of the longer range models. Rainfall totals for early Wednesday morning, not a lot. Trace amounts less than a tenth of an inch at this point, but over the next seven days, we could pick up anywhere from an inch to maybe two inches in the extreme southeastern part of the Midlands and higher amounts the closer you get to the coastal region of South Carolina, even down towards parts of Charleston and Berkeley counties, maybe up to three inches rain, that being over the next seven days. Here's our forecast across the Midlands, upper 50s, low 60s, some areas may get a little bit warmer. Mid 50s tomorrow, low to mid 60s, Thursday, Friday, low 60s on Saturday, chance rain on Sunday and Monday. The coastal forecast, small chance of rain tomorrow morning, sunny skies Thursday. It's going to be a bit breezy on Saturday, expecting rain on Sunday and Monday along the coastal region. Same thing for the upstate, chance for showers Sunday, Monday. Temperatures climbing into the lower 60s by Friday. Today, temperatures in the low 50s. As we look ahead, February 6th through February 12th, our 8 to 14 day temperature outlook is indicating warmer than normal conditions. As far as rainfall amounts are concerned during that time, same time frame, near normal conditions for us here across South Carolina, a little bit out towards our west, wetter than normal conditions are expected February 6th through February 12th.